all right what's up y'all it's 202 ink had to come on the inside because i was trying to record this video outside but clearly the sun is beaming so hard that i was going to be like this the whole video but um excuse me as you can see i'm right by the kobe's uh also by the hook and reel i actually just got some more seafood yesterday was valentine's day and i had some seafood yesterday with greg but um i came on here real quick to say <coughs> excuse me man live the life that you want to live Live how you want to live. It's possible. Don't think that you can't live the life that you want to because it's out of reach or you don't got that much money or you don't got this or you don't got that. You can make it possible. I'm telling you. You can make it possible. You just got to hustle, grind, and do what you got to do legally. I always say legally because it's too much legal money out here to be doing stuff illegal. It's not the 80s or the 70s and it's not the 90s. Shout out to my 90s babies. But you can live how you want to live and don't worry about the haters because I just made a tweet earlier that said, People will really be mad at you. You can come from the same place. People come from the same place and people will be mad at you for like going off and not going off in a bad way, but people will be, will be mad at you or hating on you for basically leaving your circumstances or showing that your circumstances don't determine where you can go. Motherfuckers be mad. Dad got cursed about them trying to, but people be mad because... Oh, we went to school. Oh, oh, me and uh, oh, me and uh, Wink went to school together, and now she doing this. And F her, this and that, or or she thinks she better than somebody because she got this or that. And it's not about that. It's about living how I want to live, seeing things, certain things growing up, and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna be able to get that when I can. Especially if your parents can't can't afford something or they don't want to do something for you or whatever. I'm not bashing my parents, but it's either like my, my motorcycle, for example. If my mom had the money for it, she would have got it for me, I believe. Let's put it like that. Nine times out of ten or fifty percent chance my parents would have got me a mini motorcycle growing up if they really had the money for it. But they didn't. It was three of us. So now that I have my own money and I have I mean I've been having my own life, but I'm old enough to support myself and do this and that, I'm gonna do what I want. I'm gonna shop where I want, buy what I want. And eat what I want. I just had, like eat what you want. That's another thing. That's a luxury. Being able to eat what you want and what you like. Hold on. Being able to eat what you want and what you like, for real though, like I, I can't, I can't stress that enough. I always tell people, like I was just telling my brother because he wanted to treat himself to a large pizza. I'm like, man, do it, cause if you die today, you gonna be like, damn. Or you die tonight, you gonna be like, damn, I should have had that pizza. You know what I'm saying? It's all about living how you want. And and for example, my uncle, he got two jobs now, and I was like, how come? And because we was doing some other side hustle stuff too that had stopped. So he was like, because the lifestyle that he wants to live or the lifestyle that he has, he needs two jobs. And okay then, same thing with me. That's why you think I got, I got my regular job. I got YouTube, my production company. That's why I'm always out Baltimore doing stuff or traveling, doing little videography stuff because I need these multiple incomes so I can live the life that I want, so I can drive my truck, so I can go ride my motorcycle, so I can go buy my new house. You know what I'm saying? And that's all I be trying to like get y'all to understand and pay attention to because for some reason, this generation, my generation and the generation under us, the little dummies, I'm sorry, but I didn't have conversations with some of these young kids. They're dumb. Let me not say that. They ain't dumb. Y'all not dumb. Y'all frontal lobe isn't developed yet. And your brain isn't fully developed until you're 25. Okay? So y'all not dumb. I'm sorry. But yeah, like, for real. Like, because I seem to think, or I seem to see, like, this generation, or where, maybe in the DMV, do y'all notice how all these young kids, besides the stupid crap, like stealing cars, you're 14. It's not like you could drive anyway. Why are you stealing cars? But it's like they think, or they have this mentality, or it's getting put into their heads that, Oh, you automatically, you know what I'm saying? I don't care where you come from because I didn't came from the worst of the worst hoods too. So it's automatically like, oh, if you want to live this way, you got to rob and steal. You know what I'm saying? Rob people, steal from people. Or uh, I don't care. These drug dealers now, like, that shit looks like worse than a 9 to 5. Like, so that's a whole another story. So I get in that in another video about the, uh, the, the, with the lifestyles. But it's like, basically... They thinking they got to live a certain lifestyle by just, like, doing illegal things, and that's not it. Been there, done that. Do it look like—I was about to say something crazy, but I'm not. But been there and done that with the criminal activities, okay? And you're talking about—you're talking to somebody that don't got a record. Okay. Either way, it's possible, man. And it's so much money out here. I'm going to do a video on so much ways to get money. Get you some real motion. The, the block ain't motion. The block going to be there seriously like that's another thing like the block gonna be there how much money you know what i'm saying no, i ain't even gonna get into it i'd be trying to stop myself but the block gonna be there 
when you come and when you go and even if you die so that's what i'm trying to say like live the life that you want to live that you can go get it you can go get some money you can go start you a company you, should, you can go do all this stuff so you can live the life that you want to live and be good and still be from the hood you know what i'm saying because people seem to think or it looks like online that people think like it's like it's, it's real life being like glorified you know what i'm saying and it's nothing wrong if that's where you come from but that's where you want to stay at and do you go off hating on people who uh decided to leave that you ain't like that for real or or the other don't when the dude was like oh you can't come back to your hood he said that to the other dude i'm like who the fuck who wants to really come back to the hood like yeah i would love to buy my childhood home but that's like not a, a thing for real like i don't want to fuck coming back to the hood like i said everybody ain't happy for you everybody ain't your friend you know what i'm saying so i'll go back and pull my friends back and do that and live our lifestyle but long story short y'all you don't have to be in the streets you don't have to be doing illegal things or none of that to live a nice lifestyle and you should want to live the lifestyle that you want and want more for yourself don't settle for less like comment subscribe share i'm hungry